Hereford syndrome, also referred to as uvaparotid fever, Hereford Milius syndrome, Hereford Waldenstrem syndrome, and Waldenstrem's uvaparotitis, is a rare manifestation of sarcoidosis. The symptoms include inflammation of the eye, uveitis, swelling of the parotid gland, chronic fever, and in some cases, palsy of the facial nerves. Causes The exact cause of Hereford syndrome has not yet been definitively determined. Of those patients who have been diagnosed with Hereford syndrome, 15% have a close relative who also has the syndrome. One possible explanation is that the syndrome results from a combination of an environmental agent and a hereditary predisposition. Mycobacterium and Propionibacteria species have both been suggested as the environmental agent, though the evidence for this is inconclusive. Diagnosis and Treatment In patients that have already been diagnosed with sarcoidosis, Hereford syndrome can be inferred from the major symptoms of the syndrome which include parotitis, fever, and facial nerve palsy. In cases of parotitis, ultrasound-guided biopsy is used to exclude the possibility of lymphoma. There are many possible causes of facial nerve palsy, including Lyme disease, HIV, Melkerson-Rosenthal syndrome, schwannoma, and Bell's palsy. Hereford syndrome exhibits spontaneous remission. Treatments for sarcoidosis include corticosteroids and immunosuppressive drugs. Prevalence In the United States, sarcoidosis has a prevalence of approximately 10 cases per 100,000 whites and 36 cases per 100,000 blacks. Hereford syndrome is present in 4.15.6% of those with sarcoidosis. History the condition was first described in 1909 by Danish ophthalmologist Christian Frederick Hereford, for whom the syndrome is now named. It was originally attributed to mumps, but after further studies by Swedish Dr. Jan G. Waldenström in 1937, it was classified as a distinct manifestation of sarcoidosis. Please subscribe and thanks for watching.